Hi, this is Intech, Technology for Inclusion. Did you know that India has a staggering 26 million people with intellectual disability? That is one in every 50. Ask yourself, when was the last time you saw a child with intellectual disability play a sport? Chances are never. So, that begs the question. As a society, are we doing enough to include them? Hi, I'm Siddhant, co-founder of Intech. and a one m one b future leader and i'm sihani from cincinnati we are two 16 year olds trying to find a solution with a mission to use motion sensing technology as a tool to impact both social inclusion and mobility for children with intellectual disabilities we are aligned with sdg number 10 The foundation of Intech was laid on expert advice and guidance by the best in the field who validated our project and gave us the confidence to go ahead. We then partnered with Jevakil, India's oldest and largest organization working with children with an intellectual disability. The joy of watching a child experience sports for the first time is unparalleled and it is what keeps me going. Let me show you a sneak peek into how things work. Shot. Good shot. Ball. Two. Due to the sheer magnitude of the problem, we at Intech felt we could do more, and for this, we have started our fundraising initiative to raise money for the technology. So far, we have raised two thousand dollars, and our target is to reach. 50 schools by the end of March of next year. We at Intech believe that the true essence of this project will come when the children are able to apply what they've learned while playing the sports into their daily lives, as is explained by a therapist here. As a physiotherapist, I've been working with Sachin after his surgery to make him stand. And honestly, there was no motivation for both of us, so it always feel like a struggle. And after three years, for the first time, Sachin has said, "Grab my splints." I can stand and I want to play standing bowling because I think I play better in standing and I don't want to play sitting. And he told me back there that no, I think even tennis I would play better standing. And I think he gave me that motivation for his life. Like now he knows the meaning and the value of what standing will bring for him. As one and one be future leaders, we have acquired many skills and learned several lessons along the way. Lessons on leadership, communication, collaboration, and many more. But above all, the biggest lesson that I've learned is the realization that us and a child with intellectual disability are not that different after all. We have the same dreams and similar aspirations of being accepted for who we are. A world that includes all is truly a better one. Join us in our journey of inclusion.